Here we're going to talk through the process in creating your front body canvas. This is a canvas that extends and covers the whole front panel of your jacket. So likewise, as mentioned in the other videos, this happens once we are happy with and we have finalised our pattern for our jacket because we are using that jacket pattern piece to create our canvas pattern piece. So it's always a good thing to make duplicates um, of your jacket front rather than cutting up um, your only original option. So here we have our jacket front pattern piece. And I've extended lower at the hem 1.5. I've come around the front, filling in the curve, not worried about the step there, coming around 1.5 wider all the way up, continuing across the lapel area, neck, shoulder and armhole all 1.5 now this is due to the fact that when we're handling the canvas due to its weave it frays quite easily so this extra allowance ensures that our canvas is still big enough um, to be viable at the end of all the uh, handwork we actually apply to it we also need to extend the canvas five centimeters underarm now, if you're not quite sure of the angle to take here, um, you can use your side panel section, put seam line to seam line. You can place one on top of the other, draw around our side panel, making sure our seam lines are together. I've got a notch there, which is approximately halfway on this seam which is equal to our five centimeters. So that's where we're looking at extending this past the front and higher by the 1.5. Once we have that in place, I have then marked the waist position and we have our dart. So from the edge of the dart, I have measured 6.6 centimeters then with a curve we have marked from the underarm curving around into that point on the waist and then from the waist curved gently back out over the hip to the edge of the jacket front down to the hem then we need to make some amendments to the dart because the construction of the dart on the outside of, of the outside of the jacket, our main body fabric, is different to the body canvas. So we are going to create some changes to its structure. So the original position of the top of the dart on the jacket front, we have lifted 2.5 centimetres. This means the ends of the darts are not in the same place, reducing the bulk or any distortion that could affect the outside of the jacket and the clean lines. And it'll also then we have our pocket position going here, which can distract from that. With that raised 2.5 centimeters, draw a line back in to the positions of the dart at the waist. I've applied the same principle here at the bottom as this is our pocket position and the base of the dart. I've extended that 2.5 but we have now put a point to this dart not a wide end due to the construction being changed so this is a double-ended dart and we have drawn that in. So that outer line is our front body canvas pattern piece. And then this section here of the dart is also cut out. And then there is clearly shown how to construct the front canvas piece um, in the videos that follow. The worksheet that accompanies this for 
the students uh, with me in the uni is uh, worksheet number six and pages two to three.